So the two spade response does promise some values. Because if you had a weak hand with uh, no support for spades, you would still just bid two hearts. If you had a weak hand with both majors, you would bid three hearts, which shows specifically that holding. So the two spade response is normally at least a decent intermediate hand, probably with a spade shortage, expecting to play in spades if partner has spades, but expecting to play in game if opener has anything other than a weak two in spades. So if you're sort of 18 plus with uh, a couple of small spades, then two spades is not the bid to make because now you could potentially make a game opposite even a relatively low range weak two in spades if it's a reasonable suit. So if you've got, you know, 16 plus, it may be best to to try two no trumps rather than two spades. So we'll come to that next week. So this is a fairly crucial point here. If... Uh, the bidding starts two diamonds, two spades, and ops interfere, then opener must pass if they've got the weak two in spades. If they start bidding anything, then it's going to be showing a different kind of hand than the one that they want. Bear in mind that if ops interfere over two diamonds, two spades, and opener's got a weak two in spades, responder has no further interest. They wanted to play in two spades. If ops have bid past that, then so be it. Just let them play. Any questions so far before we move on? So here, North's opened the multi-two diamonds. South's got quite a nice intermediate hand, but a spade shortage. He's got superb support for hearts in case uh, North has a weak two in hearts. But he's not really got any, any interest in playing beyond the two level if partner has a weak two in spades. So south bids two spades. And north passes to show the weak two in spades. And once again, if east-west start interfering over the two spade bid, I either first in hand or third in hand, um, then North just passes and you can guarantee that South will also pass because he's no further interest in playing any higher if North has a weak two in spades.
I'll be coming to that in a minute, Sonia. Okay, I'll, I'll be coming to, to rebids if North has a week to enhance. That's the whole point in this lesson. So we'll come to the, the, the hands where North has a week to in hearts shortly. Uh, I'm going to take these in order. So two no trumps would be the cheapest bid over two spades. Two diamonds, two spades. So two no trumps is the lower range four 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 ones. And just like before, three clubs asks and now opener bids the suit below. The difference here is that because North has shown some values with the two spade bid, um, because they've implied particularly uh, game interest in hearts, uh, eater asks are permitted below game level. A little bit of common sense required here, uh, as I've said there. So, for example, um, if if North has a four-card heart suit, for example, if Opener has a four-card heart suit, and South ends up bidding four hearts. At when that's the minimum level that they could make an eater at because South has shown really good support for hearts it would be sensible for opener to take that as an eater ask because responder is showing a, a decent uh, intermediate hand with really good support for hearts so opposite you know particularly if it's say uh, a 19 count that that opener has with four, say one four 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 shape, or four four one four, for example, with four hearts. If the cheapest level that responder could make an eater at is at the level of four hearts, it would be sensible for opener to take that as an eater ask rather than a sign off in game because Responder has shown a decent intermediate hand by bidding two spades in the first place um, and they've shown good support for hearts. Anybody not understand what I'm trying to get across there? As I said here, it's very unlikely that Responder will have less than an 11 count. And the other thing, of course, that does make a difference is... Uh, North's sort of fit for spades if they've got lots of wasted values in spades because responder is almost certainly got a spade shortage if they've got something like king jack xx in spades then worth devaluing their hand somewhat um because the hand's obviously not fitting well. But obviously, if they've got something like Ace XXX in spades, then that's probably going to be a very good fit in spades. When uh, responders known to have a shortage there. Okay, any questions on the, the lower range 4441s before we move on? Okay, so over two diamonds, two spades, the the layout of the uh, the combinations is somewhat different. 
so over two diamonds, two spades, three clubs shows the eight trick hand with clubs and spades, not clubs and hearts, as it was over two diamonds, two hearts. But similarly to the sequences over the two diamond, two hearts, we do have eleven sol available over the three club rebid. So over two diamonds, two spades, three clubs, three diamonds is eleven sol, three hearts is beta, and three no trumps is a sort of distribution ask. And it's along similar lines to the, the distribution ask over the uh, two diamonds, two hearts, three club bid. It's not identical because obviously we're talking about different suits. The reason why we don't have any asking bids here is because at least one of the suits that this is showing is one that Responder has already shown he's got no interest in, i.e. spades. So we know when it started off two diamonds, two spades, we know that... Uh, responder isn't going to be interested in the spades so in case in case responder also doesn't actually have a decent fit for clubs which is entirely possible uh, we don't have any really strong sequences here normally the distribution ask is is going to be the way to go or <laughs> excuse me uh, an immediate beta Okay, so so the only the only strong bids we have here, uh, apart from what I've shown there, is the four club bid, which is gamma in clubs. So we don't have any strong bids for spades because we know that uh, responder doesn't have any support for spades. And don't forget, this is a um, a six card minimum length. So note that in in this instance, we don't have any of this thing about four no trumps not being available as relay beta, uh, because uh, responder knows immediately the sort of hand 
that South has, i.e. an 8-trick hand with a 5-card major and a 6-card minor, um, there's no way that he's going to want to play in 3 no-trumps. If he wants to play in, in no-trumps, he would be bidding 3 no-trumps over 3 clubs. And especially here, where Respond has shown a six-card suit with two of the top three honours. Um, there's no way he's going to want to sign off in no trumps. Now, in practice, North might even take a stab at seven clubs here um, because he knows that South has at, at most two cards in the red suit. So his two aces are going to take care of that. And similarly, uh, because South can only have two cards in the red suit, it's impossible in practice for him or it's difficult for him not to have the ace of spades. He could have king x of diamonds and king queen jack of spades, it's true. Um, in this instance, I think he would be... Uh, he'd be okay, actually. Um, As long as he took the roughing finesse against West, um, but no, sorry, he, he wouldn't be able to make seven clubs here. So it would be a bit of a stab in the dark. But if the spades were four-three, uh, then he would be able to rough them out. But there's no cheap way that he can make that sort of inquiry over five diamonds. If he bids five spades epsilon, which is available, um, then even second and third round control is going to take him as far as six hearts, and that's too high. So he can't afford to make that ask. Okay, moving on. So you'll notice here that the first two, uh, the first two bids that we've looked at over two diamonds, two spades, the three clubs and three diamond bids show that minor in spades. Because we know that uh, if Responder is going to be interested in anything over the sequence, it'll be the minor. It won't be spades. 
in the other ones where uh, opener is showing an eight trick hand with heart we know for certain that that is the suit that responders are going to be interested in because they've already shown uh, strong game interest if uh, if opener has a weak two in hearts let alone if they got an eight trick intermediate hand with hearts and a minor so again you can ignore the three spade bid because there's no way that, that respond is ever going to start asking in spades four diamonds over the three diamonds is gamma in diamonds um, theoretically three spades is gamma in spades but in practice it's never going to happen three hearts is leaven soul three no trumps is the distribution ask again similar lines to uh, the ones over two diamonds two hearts it's only the suits that are different and four clubs is beta but responder has to set the suit the contract thereafter if he uses that normally they'll make um, the four diamonds gamma bid here Again, it's unlikely that three no trumps is going to be uh, a, a decent resting spot, but it's not impossible. So to get to three no trumps, you just use Levin Soul and then sign off in three no trumps, and that will be 100% to play. I think I've got an example of that. So, so the five-step response is showing a seven-card diamond suit. Still got five spades, but seven-card diamond suit uh, with two top honours, which is just what South wanted to hear. And in practice, as with, with quite a lot of these hands, in practice, North would open this one club. Um, give him, say, the ace, jack, 10, x, x uh, of spades, and he might open it two diamonds. With ace, king in both of his long suits and a 7-5 hand, there's no way you're not going to open this one club. But every hand is... 
uh, is different. Um, normally these hands will be fairly lower range, uh, especially if all the points are in the long suits. So the, the north hand here isn't very representative. Um, but give north ace-jack-10 to 5, in which case they'll be bidding 6 diamonds over uh, 5 hearts. Um, and you'd probably still reach... Um, You'd almost certainly still reach seven diamonds, but that would be more representative. Okay, um, Sanya, I take your point. It's going to have to wait its turn, that I'm afraid. I might try and do um, some midweek seminars on, on hand evaluation and defensive and declare a play generally uh, once we've started the, the next simple OCP session in September. I've no scope for doing that really between now and then. Okay, so we'll break off from the uh the five six hands for now. So two diamonds, two spades, three hearts shows a lower range week two in hearts. Don't forget uh, a responder by bidding two spades has shown potential game interest in hearts but not in spades so if effectively north has a hand that was only interested if in being in game in hearts if opener was up a range they can still just pass three hearts. There's no um, uh, nothing that says they have to bid four hearts. Um, but three spades is a forcing inquiry, asking opener to show a shortage if they have one. And again, they bid the suit below just in case opener wants to use a beta and over the three spade forcing inquiry they just bid four hearts if they are six three two two shape and now four spades will be beta if if responder does make that distribution inquiry and then does use beta we do allow responder to start using epsilons because we know that hearts are the agreed suit here alternatively over two diamonds two spades three hearts three no trumps is just an immediate beta agreeing heart and epsilons are so responder doesn't have to ask about singletons but they can do um, and to be honest with you, normally would. But it depends. They may have a long suit of their own, and it mostly depends on uh, how good openers fit for their long suit is as to whether they bid a slam or not. Okay, any questions about the three heart rebid showing a lower range week two in hearts?
So probably here, um, actually West wouldn't bother with the shortage inquiry because there's no way that East has a spade shortage. Um, and if over the three spade bids, it turns out they've got a club shortage, um, then possibly this is not going to make. But on the other hand, uh, I, I think you'd want to be in game here anyway, just based on the heart fit. So West might just bid four hearts over three hearts and not bothered with the three spade inquiry. Because it's most likely that it's going to be a diamond shortage. Um, it won't be a spade shortage with north-south staying silent. But uh, they're already too high if it's a club shortage and we're going to be losing three diamond tricks and a spade trick straight off the top. Okay, so the three spade rebid over two spades is an upper range week two in hearts that, that has a heart shortage. Uh, sorry, some kind of a shortage. And similar to over the three heart bid, a relay in the next bid up, three no trumps, asks an opener bids the suit below four hearts with a club shortage three diamonds with a spade shortage and so on um, three clubs with a diamond shortage and again these these are easy easy wins because responder has already shown game interest if open has a week two in hearts so it's almost inevitable that you're going to play in four hearts at least when uh, opener does have especially an upper range week two in heart so we're effectively the three spade bid is effectively forcing us to play in four hearts whether we like it or not because responder has already shown interest in that Bear with me. Okay, I don't have an example hand of, of this. Anybody got any questions before we move on? You're all very quiet tonight disturbs me okay so we're now we're back to the higher range 4441s so two diamonds two spades three no trumps two no trumps showed the lower range 4441s three no trumps shows the higher range ones and were effectively uh, just the same but a level higher so four clubs ask for the location of singleton Opener bids the suit below uh, and bids four no trumps with a diamond singleton. The difference here is that we're definitely going to be in a slam zone. If uh, Responder bids two spades, then uh, they're definitely a reasonable intermediate hand. And if Opener is 
20 to 23 points we're almost certainly looking at a slam somewhere um, so we do allow the first bid in any of openers four card suits is eater whether it's at or above game level and asking bids are established but if responder doesn't bother with eater and just makes a beta ask in the singleton suit then they have to set the final contract afterwards But I'm not going to spend too much time on the 4441s because it's so similar to uh, the sort of scheme of, of things that you've come across elsewhere. The difference with the 3 no Trump rebid is that we allow ETA asks at the minimum level in any suit, whatever level that is, even if it's at game level. Because we know that we're talking about... Uh, slam hands the only suit that we're not likely to start making eater asks in is spades uh, because we know that responder doesn't have support for spades Okay, so now we come to the atrix hands that have hearts. So three clubs and three diamonds were both that minor and spades. We can afford to go higher when the second, well, when the major is hearts because we know already that responder has game interest opposite a week two in hearts. So he's almost certainly going to have slam interest in hearts when opener has an eight trick hand with hearts and a minor. So all of the subsequent bidding assumes that hearts is the agreed suit because of the two spade response to two diamonds. And it also assumes that Responder is unlikely to be shorting clubs because they've already effectively shown a spade shortage. And it won't be terribly often that they have two shortages. Just in case uh, two spades was really a bit of a mistake, um, we do allow four hearts and five clubs to be strictly to play. Um, if despite opener having an eight trick hand and responder having shown um, a reasonable intermediate hand with um, a spade shortage and good support for hearts uh, it's theoretically possible that they will still want to sign off in game in hearts or maybe even in clubs but in practice I've never seen that to happen over two diamonds, two spades. So four diamonds over four clubs is a forcing inquiry. Um, and basically it's like a gamma between the two long suits combined. In other words, it's asking how many top honours in total have you got in clubs and hearts? So four hearts would show three top honours between the two suits. Four spades shows four top honours between the two suits. And four no trumps shows five top honours between the two suits. In practice, four no trumps are going to be pretty rare um, because it would mean that uh, uh, even with king-queen, ace-king-queen, um, there's no way because that's a 
um, nearly a one club opener and, and he would be opening one club if he had king queen ace king queen between the two suits but uh, it's there just in case um, so normally it'll get a four diamonds will get a four heart or a four spade response so a relay then the relay over that response asks about distribution and one step shows 1516, two step shows a diamond void, and three step shows a spade void. If that relay isn't used, then bids in side suits are epsilon. If the relay is used, then where they've shown a shortage, the cheapest bid in the short suit is going to be beta. Let's see if I've got an example hand of this. Okay, so at this stage, East knows that West has got uh, at least the King Queen of Hearts and the King Queen of Clubs. Might be the ace king, might be the ace queen of clubs, might be the king queen. All he knows is four top honours between the two suits. Okay, so I said that the relay over that gamma response, the gamma in the two suits combined, the relay is asking about a shortage. So now pass takes the, the, uh, the place of the relay. And again, D1P, D1P2 um, still works in this sort of a situation. One, one step was going to be 1516 shape, and uh, um, so the redouble takes the place of that. So now we know that West has got a diamond shortage, so five diamonds is beta.
note that if uh, if West only had king queen of spades and king queen of clubs, they'd only have two controls. They'd have bid five hearts over um, five diamonds, and we would have played there. So five diamonds is pretty safe. If West has the ace queen of clubs, um, they'll be bidding five spades, in which case it's six on the finesse. If you get a spade lead on any other lead, you can get rid of the spade leader. So it's a good shot. Okay, so, so don't forget that the, the principles behind D1P2 still apply in this kind of a situation. So over the double of four spades, pass is the cheapest thing that East can do. So that takes the place of the distribution inquiry. And redouble is the one-step response to that pass distribution inquiry. Um, that shows 1516 shape so 5 diamonds is the cheapest uh, bid in one of West's shortages that East can make so that's beta so again you have to think on your feet slightly with these but as long as you understand that the um, the four diamond response to four clubs is gamma counting up the top honours in both of West's long suits. He's not interested about aces in a side suit. He's interested in uh, how many top honours West has in total in his two suits. That's aces, kings and queens. So here West has four top honours between clubs and hearts. He's got the king, queen of hearts and the ace, king of clubs. Um, so he goes two steps over four diamonds. Any questions? This is, this is a different kind of technique to, to what you've come across. This is the only place where this combined gamma appears is in... Uh, these four clubs and four diamonds uh, rebids by opener. So you won't have come across this before, but it should be fairly easy for you to understand. Um, if uh, opener somehow only has two top honours between the two, he just shows it as three. Um, effectively, it's showing up to three, but no more than that. But if he's got an eight trick hand, it's. Well, it's not quite exclusion. It's it's just trying because it's looking for queens as well. Um, it's specifically looking to see how solid um, the suits are. The point being that. If East has got a good intermediate hand with a spade shortage here, the chances are that he's going to have some support for clubs as well as hearts. He hasn't here because he's got a big red two suitor. But but actually this is, you know, not a typical East hand. It would be norm, more normal perhaps for him to have, say, one less diamond and one more club. So now the solidity of the clubs is an issue just as much as the solidity of the hearts. And don't forget, it's possible that, that, that West has got ace, king, queen of, um, of clubs and only queen, jack, ten to five hearts. Not impossible. 
Um, in which case, you know, your your six heart slam is on a finesse. So it's only asking, it's asking combined between the two long suits. Is everybody clear on that? Okay, last lap. Okay, as with as with the four uh, club rebid over two diamonds, two spades, four diamonds shows the atric hand with diamonds and hearts, and we assume that hearts are agreed here, because again, uh, responders already shown game interest in hearts. It's unlikely they're going to have less than uh, four cards support for hearts in those circumstances. Certainly they're not going to have less than three card support. So a bit like over four clubs, four hearts and five diamonds are strictly to play just in case um, uh, Responder was being a little bit um, economical with the truth with their two spade response. In other words, they might actually have a fairly weak hand, but a spade shortage, and just decided to bid spades, and, and they don't fancy going further than game in hearts. Not recommended that you do that, but it's a reasonable, reasonable thing. Um, so again, four spades... Um, over four diamonds is the forcing inquiry um, sort of gamma combining the two top suits so four no trumps the one step response shows three top honors between diamonds and hearts sorry that should be diamonds and hearts not uh, clubs and hearts and five clubs shows four top honors between the two suits five diamonds unlikely to however happen but just in case Five diamonds shows five top honours between the two suits. Almost for certain you're going to get a four no trump or a five club response. And again, just like we saw, the relay over the response is asking about distribution. One step shows one five six one shape. Two step shows a club void. Three step shows a spade void. And once we've shown, once we've made that relay asking about distribution any bid in any of uh, uh, openers shortages um, so I mean the cheapest the cheapest shortage bid and the shortage that we can make is beta if we don't use the distribution inquiry then you don't have beta um, and side suits are epsilon so it may well be that um, there's one particular suit that, res that responder needs to ask about and they might ignore the distribution inquiry just so that they can make an immediate cheaper epsilon in that side suit Let's see if I've got a there we are.
so here's here's the gamma in the two suits combined and this time we do have five um, And like I said, in practice, there's no way East isn't going to open this one club. But it's just to show you. Um, so here, um, West knows, since there are only six top honours between the two red suits, West knows that East has ace king queen to five hearts and king queen to six diamonds. Um, he knows that his two black suit, his two black aces are going to take care of any black suit losers that uh, East has and barring a 4-0 heart split if East doesn't have the jack as well um, that's absolutely solid And last but not least, so the three spade bid, sorry, the three spade rebid over two diamonds, two spades showed the upper range week two, sorry, the upper range week two in hearts with a shortage. An immediate bid of four hearts shows an upper range week two without a shortage. If uh, responder wants, they can bid four no trumps over four hearts as a general slam try, asking for a side suit control. In practice, uh, over two diamonds, two spades is not likely to happen. Um, when the uh, opener is known to be 6 3 2 2 shape without a shortage, it's unlikely over two spades that we're going to be strong enough to go significantly beyond the game level uh, without some shape in the opening hand. I don't think I have an example of that. No, sorry. Anybody got any questions on, on the two diamond, two spade sequences? Yeah, I mean, the one consolation is that, um, as I've said there, uh, in practice, when it goes anything... You can almost divide um, these hands into two different varieties. There are hands where it starts two diamonds, two hearts, and opener has a strong variety, i.e. either the strong four, four, four ones or the strong uh, eight trick hands. Or it goes two diamonds, two spades, or two diamonds, two no trumps, in which case, almost invariably, 
opener's got a week too. Um, it's not very often that you get a two spade response and opener shows a strong hand of some sort. Um, most common that they'll show a week two in heart or pass two spades. But never say never. Nobody got any questions? If so, we'll practice some stuff. Three more, please. Come on, guys. Don't be shy. Come on, people. I'm not going to sit here all night. I don't really want to play three-handed bridge against Roger. The hell with you all. I have a good mind just to uh, go to bed. Just you and me, Roger. Yeah, you, you, you. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> It's not about schizophrenic. Having three multiple personalities is even worse. It's besides the point, Sanya. It's not even true, but it's beside the point. You sat and watched the lesson. Have a sit, West uh, Clement. Could we have an East, please? I don't care who it is, and I don't care how clueless you think you are. <laughs> Thank you, Charlene. Right, okay. Thank you very much, Charlene. You were about to get dragooned by Naomi, some of you. She was just going to pick names out of her hat. Unfortunately, I can't force you to sit. Okay, so here we had a week two. Uh, South showed good support for hearts, but not for spades. And I've passed because I've got a week two in spades. So everybody's happy. We're going to lose one, two, three, four, five tricks. I'm going to make five spades and the three aces. And in, if we get a chance. We might, but on a club lead, we are going to make those five tricks.
Any questions, anybody? If anybody decides they want to sit north, please let me know and you can sit. These hands are no fun for me because I set them, I created them and I can see all 52 cards because it's a teaching table. So it's no fun for me. Right, you guys, East West, have a go at these. You can't what, Clement? You can't see the east and south hands. Well, you should only be able to see your west hand. Yeah, I guess that's what you were saying. You should only be able to see the west hand at the moment. Charlene, just stop there a minute. Three heart shows a lower range week two. The range for the week twos is ostensibly five to nine high card points. So you're actually maximum. So you need to be bidding three spades here because you've got a maximum week two with a shortage somewhere. So three spades doesn't show a spade suit. Spade, three spades just shows an upper range week two in hearts with a shortage somewhere. Roger, it's you to pass. Maybe. I know you've got a very strong hand, Roger, but... You might want to wait until you find out where uh, East shortage is. Um, really? Okay, no problem, Roger. Uh, Clement, you've shown game interest in hearts with your two spade bid. And East has shown an upper range week two in hearts with a shortage somewhere. Do you really want to play this in three spades? when you know you've got a 10 card heart fit? I thought not. No, no, the two spade bid was fine. You just need to bid four hearts here. Jesus. Clement, the current bid is three spades, which shows a week two in hearts, upper range. The whole point, right, the whole point about this is that two spades shows game interest in hearts.
Okay. If the vulnerability was other than it is, it's not unknown for... Okay, thanks, Clement. Uh, it's not unknown for uh, North House, South um, cards, North South pairs to start bidding spades at this point. Um, on the basis that West has a known shortage in spades and East has got a six card heart fit. So it's almost, almost a racing certainty that North South have a spade fit. This is the wrong vulnerability for that. And especially when East shows an upper range week two, um, it's also fairly certain that actually the spades, the spades aren't going to fit very well for you. Oh, is it me? I'm sorry. Uh. Okay, comments, claim. Okay, so well done. Um, I think that maybe there was some sort of misunderstanding here before uh, between Clement. Do you see the idea? Over three spades, we know we've, East West know they've got a 10 card heart fit. There's no way that West is going to want to play in three spades on a, f a maximum 4 nil fit. That would be indeed a bit quixotic. The whole rationale behind the responses here are that when East has an upper range week two, we're going to play this in four hearts, come what may. Maybe further, maybe higher even, if uh, West is on the upper range of Mintermediate and the fit looks good. So over three spades, three no trumps would ask where the shortage is. Thanks, Clement. Three no trumps would ask where the shortage is and we bid the suit below. So four clubs by East would show a diamond shortage. In practice here, West isn't really interested because we know that East shortage isn't likely to be in spades. So it's going to be in one of the minors and neither of them is particularly good. Thank you, Sanya. Hence, West bidding four hearts over three spades because um, it's not the ideal situation for them. Okay, next hand. Again, if somebody wants to sit north, please let me know and you can come and sit. Okay, so South has got the, the lower range 4441 hand. Where did the dogs hoofs um, come from? Can, sorry? Where did the dogs find their hoofs from? Well, they went long ago. The dog hoof chews. Don't know. Uh, yeah, I'll put it on, Roger. Sorry, just bear with me. He's not said a word. All right. No, he did hear you. <laughs> he says hi back.
Uh, no, Roger. You don't bid the shortage. You don't bid the short suit. You bid the suit below your short suit. And you have to work out. So three diamonds shows a heart shortage. Three hearts shows a spade shortage. Three spades shows a club shortage. And three no trumps shows a diamond shortage. Okay, and this is one of the situations where um, uh, that I was talking about before, where uh, North has already shown strong interest in Hart, and South has shown a strong hand type. The cheapest level at which I can make a four heart eater, an eater ask, is at the level of four hearts. So, particularly because it's hearts, um, where Roger's shown a four card heart suit, which he has here, Roger should take this as an eater ask, not as a sign off. Even though even though he's in the lower range of the 4441 hands, um, it's unlikely that this is just wanting to play in four hearts. I was happy to play in four hearts opposite to week two, and Rogers got 16 to 19 high card points. So this is Eater. So this is Relay Beta. And this is using the strong scale, don't forget, because Roger is known to be 16 plus. So it's 0 to 4, 5, 6, 7. Well, not really, because if 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 Roger goes beyond the level of six hearts, I'm going to six hearts, come what may. Um, I've got a 14 count with six controls opposite a 16 to 19 4441 four, four, Sanya. Um, there's no way I'm going to stop below six hearts. Um, if Roger shows me six or seven controls, I'm going to go to... Um, seven hearts but five no trump shows four controls or naught to four so that's enough for me
Okay, well done, Roger. Um, so at the times when you might have a game level bid that's to play is if Roger shows uh, a heart shortage i.e. a 4-4-4-1-4-1-4-4 hand with a heart shortage uh, now it's a bit more problematic if I start making a potential eater ask at game level because I've shown interest in hearts we know I don't have any interest in spades um, but at least the uh, the eater would be in a minor below game level it's going to be four clubs or four diamonds we know I'm not going to ask about spades because I've already shown a spade shortage if Roger's got a heart shortage the choice is going to be between playing in one of the two minors Any questions before we move on? Okie coke. Mehmet or uh, Octay, if you want to sit north, please tell me. I'm more than happy to stand and let you sit. Lead so your side would declare. Um, not quite sure what you mean, Sanya. Mehmet, was that you want to was that you want to sit? Yeehaw. Come on, Mehmet, in you go. Much better. Um, is there an interpreter in the house? Oh, I see. Um, no, that's not fair, Sonia. The whole point is that you get to practice these sequences. All right, we've got a one club opener from West here. <laughs> Roger, it's you. Uh -huh. Now what you're going to do, Sanya? No, it's all right. 
It's you to pass, Roger. Yeah, but it's... Indeed. Go on, Sanya, go for it. I think you'll find there's some nice inferential choices to be made. Uh, no, Charlene, four spades, please. In fact, sorry, four no trumps. This is theta. Four hearts shows a, a singleton on a, or a doubleton club. Four no trump shows two top honours, doubleton or three to an honour. So now we have clubs agreed as trumps. <laughs> uh huh. Okay, Sanya, you need to think about what asking bid. You already know that East has six controls, and you know they've got three to the Queen in clubs. There is one asking bid that will tell you exactly what controls that they have. You need to actually think about this quite carefully. There's one asking bid that you want to make. You need to think about this logically. If you were if you were used to sort of crafting ask, ask, asking sequences, it would come fairly easily to you. This, no, wrong one. The thing is this: uh, just just before we go on, just just stop a second, guys. If you think about this, if you ask in, what are the possibilities for these six controls, Sanya? West has either, sorry, East has either got two aces and two kings, or they've got three aces. That's the only possibility. The danger, from your point of view, is when East has the ace king of diamonds, the ace of hearts, and the king of spades. That's the danger. Okay, so actually you need to ask in spades because the spade response will tell you. <coughs> if they show second round control or second and third, then you'll know that they have got the ace of hearts. And, and whatever their spade response, you can afford to play in six hearts effectively. Even if you can't play in six clubs. But if, if they show, well, no, it's not in, in practice because um, they might bid six spades, but if they bid six spades, then they must have the ace of spades, the ace of hearts, and the ace of diamonds. And you know that seven no trumps is cold. 
when they bid when they show if they show second round control maximum in spades you'll know that they've got the king of spades the ace of hearts and the ace king of diamonds but six is the limit indeed you might want to play in six no trumps so so bid five spades not five hearts because that's the one ask that will tell you I suppose you could actually bid four diamonds as well in fact four diamonds would do just as well sorry yeehaw so this is first and second round control or no no control it can't be no control because they've got six controls they must have at least the king of spades and actually they could have the ace king of spades no seven no trumps bid, just bid seven no trumps Sanya because they've got to have the ace of hearts here I think Yes, they've got to have the Ace of Hearts. Doesn't doesn't matter what their heart holding is, if they've got the stiff Ace of Hearts, you can still bid seven no trumps. The five no trump bid guarantees that they've got the Ace of Spades. Oh, actually, no. Sorry, I'm I'm wrong. You you do want to be in seven clubs sorry they might have the ace king of spades the ace of hearts and the king of diamonds sorry I was wrong Sanya bid seven clubs not seven no trumps you can't afford seven and So actually, yes, diamonds is is the better ask. So four diamonds, sorry, five diamonds over four no trumps, get six diamonds, and now they can't not have the three aces. Five hearts is the one one that you can't afford to ask even though it seems the most logical because it doesn't tell you what they have in spades five diamonds is best because when it when East bids six diamonds they've got to have all three aces and now you can bid seven no trumps yes you, you just have to think it through logically yeah um, you have to think what can partner have for their six controls if they if if west can figure out that if you've got all three aces missing aces and the queen of clubs then it doesn't even matter if you've got a stiff ace of hearts we can still make five heart tricks because west has got the king queen jack ten five so they don't need you to have heart support they know you've got the club support the clubs are absolutely solid so they need to work out what what they can ask that will actually tell them whether you've got the three aces and I was I was thinking that five spades would be it but actually it's not it's it's five diamonds because when you bid six diamonds you can't have the king of diamonds as well which means you must have the ace of spades without the king otherwise you won't have six controls if uh, East bids five hearts over five diamonds now that shows first and second round control of diamonds can't be anything else and now you would bid five spades to confirm 
Five spades would also show first and second round control. Um, and that would suggest that you had something like a eight card heart suit because both would have to be the stiff ace. Because the one thing is for certain, for certain, is that you do have the ace of hearts here. You can't not have the ace of hearts. Oh, actually, no, that's wrong. You can not have the ace of hearts. You could have the ace king of spades and the ace king of diamonds. Sorry, guys, it's late at night. I'm not thinking very straight. Um... Five diamonds is definitely the right ask, though. Um, it is. I, and, I mean, these things, as you've just seen, you know, um, you actually have to think it through. There are actually more permutations and combinations as to where the missing two controls are. Yeah, probably. <laughs> Okay, anybody else got any questions about this one? As you can see, if, if you think about it carefully enough, you can actually get to the right answer that five diamonds, getting a response of six diamonds, um, gives you the right answer. If East has got the ace of diamonds without the king, which is what six diamonds is showing, then they must have ace, 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 and not ace, king, ace, king. Okay, next hand. Where are we? Uh, time for one more, I think. Note there, by the way, that, that um, Sanya chose to open one club rather than two diamonds. She had a nice 14 count, I think. Um, and it's, it's perfectly okay to upgrade that to one club. In practice, the, uh, the two diamond sequence would probably have been a little bit quicker, I think. <laughs> It would certainly have been shorter. But you can't always rely on partner having a 14 count opposite. So game for four, for hearts, but not for spades. So Mehmet has the eight trick hand with diamonds and spades so he bids the diamonds at the three level not the four level four diamonds would be showing diamonds and hearts So here, four diamonds is gamma in diamonds, if South wants.
So minimum six card length, don't forget, Mehmet. RLB. No idea, Sanya. Anybody want to interpret? So, six card suit with two or three top honours. So now five clubs would be relay beta. A strong scale here, don't forget. Actually, no, sorry, it's not the strong scale. What am I talking about? North is 11 to 15 and probably lower range between that. So, no, sorry, it's not the strong scale. It's the weak, it's the normal scale. Here. So five clubs, five diamonds. Five no trumps, Mehmet. Sorry, I was giving you tough info. So Roger already knows about the Ace King of Diamonds. He's got another um, two controls split between the majors, potentially. The danger, I suppose, is that he might have King X of Hearts and king queen to five dire spades that is a possibility and it would have to be king x of hearts and a, a, a club void that would be the only time it can't be the singleton king of hearts because he wouldn't count that yeah you just have to go for it It's a good bet that, Roger, in practice. Very good, well done. Okay, anybody got any questions about the two diamond, two spade sequences before we all go to our beds or home or whatever? Um, the ones that are complicated are the ones with the uh, the sort of two suited gamma asks, if you like, where it's asking about how many top honours you have split between the two suits. Um, that's a sort of completely new concept to you if you haven't come across it before and it's the only place where where those sorts of bids are used um, 
Okay, guys, well done. Uh, we'll stop there for tonight. And uh, we'll, uh, we'll cover two diamonds, two no trumps next week, which, funnily enough, is significant.